Obviously, it's been fortunate for you to have those two fighters drop out. What did you think when Jermaine and Megan pulled out of the fight? Um, I think it's coward. <laughs> I think when you have a belt, uh, you're supposed to fight the best there is. That's that's what being a world champion is. So you fight everybody they put in front of you. You don't say no to anybody. And um, I think that in Jermaine's sake, I think I think that she just. Uh, she knew she wasn't the champion, you know what I mean? I think that she knew she wasn't going to win that fight or, or didn't have confidence she wasn't going to lose that fight or win that fight or whatever. So I think that she just pulled out for that reason. I, I just, at the end of the day, whether she's she's cheated in the past or not or whatever everybody wants to say is the reason, I, I just personally don't care. Uh, she's making the weight and she's passing drug tests. So she's in the weight class. USC has her on the roster. So you fight her or you don't. People have been talking about Cyborg. When is she going to be a champion in the UFC for, for years now? now Oh, for my whole career. <laughs> Is that a joke? My whole career. I mean, everybody I beat gets signed with the UFC. So it's a, uh, it's been one of the things that, um, you know, I just sat back and watched, and I, I finally accepted and um, just decided to let it go. And I, I wasn't upset about it. I just went along with it and enjoyed where I was at and the, the experiences I had and the title I had in Invicta. So. Do you have any sense of why they weren't interested in signing you? I'm too good looking, guys. Too good looking. I'm single. None of you guys. You all be single. If I was in the UFC. No, I'm just kidding. Ha, 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 ha.